again. That's it. Right there. <laughs> I love pauses. <laughs> pauses in fucking radio are great. Anyways. Yeah. It's, um, <laughs> I got to pee and poop. Anyways, uh, YKWD, you know what, dude? What's happening? We're back. We're back. We're back. Patreon, you're the best. Thanks for uh, being a part of that. Uh, somebody grabbed the door. <laughs> And uh, we have a very special guest today. <laughs> Mike, the He's one of my favorite people. Put your headphones on so you can hear that you're not talking into the microphone. I'm hearing you. No, you're not hearing me because you're not talking into the microphone. I don't want to get too close because I'm sick. That's why. But we're going to throw that out after you're done. We'll spray. It. Oh, okay. We're going to spray. We're going to throw it out. Like you. <laughs> He's sick. He's got AIDS. Um. Anyways. So yeah, we get the great, the legend, Rich Voss is here. Mike just came up with a really bad face. What's wrong with you? What? Stairs. Oh, stairs hurt you. Anyways, Rich Voss is here today. Um, yeah, so no one's going to be up in a second. Yeah, Mike Fiona is right. We actually uh, overbooked the show, and uh, we had to cancel a couple guests today. Casey... Balsham. And Casey. James Salango. Never book two Casey's. Okay. Without, I don't book two Joes. Completely don't, different people. Don't, I don't like Casey Casey. Okay. It's bad luck. Really? I think so. Okay. I think I made that up, but I think so. It sounds well, like I a bad you. luck thing. Anyways, we had to cancel. Uh, and, and Tim Dillon uh, said he was going to be here, but that fat cluster fuck never showed up. You just fart? He's oh, gar. Oh he, listen to me. I bumped into um we had we had we had him booked, but he didn't show. But you know what? Rich Foss showed. Listen. Sick showed up. Yeah. Drunk Old Thursday. showed up. Old washed up. <laughs> Nowhere else to be. <laughs> <laughs> that was kind of a come on. <laughs> Look at that. Hey. When can I start yelling at Mike? Anytime now, you want. Or fucking up my social media that I pay him for. Did you? Well he I Every day he should have been promoting my CD. Every day, like a couple times. A day. Coming up with new things a and couple, other yeah. things and talking yeah. to you about it. Yeah, I sent him a picture of the album cover, and every now and then I'll see a post that he throws up on Instagram or Facebook. Are you checking your stories though? Because I don't yeah. I, on Instagram. I do not listen to me. Instagram's two different things. Instagram main is very sacred. What goes up there is big, yeah. and I let it sit and stew. Simmer, they call it. Yeah. On the story is where you put all stuff, all kinds of different stuff every day. Let them go there. They'll see a 15 second this, a 15 or 30 second of that. Yeah, the last thing I sent him was cleaning my gutters, maybe. Did you yeah. put is that, that on your story? That goes on your story. Yeah. yeah, people love the story, dude. It's I a story them, of what you're doing. But, but how what's can, going on? Then what can he do with my CD, new CD in the story? What, actually, no, what, not what can he do? What can you do? He's the one who I pay to do that story. No, he puts it up. And get in like the cruise for kids stuff, and I can answer this, Bobby. Yeah. Oh shit. So, so but basically, we put. I'd rather have Bobby answer it. <laughs> so anyway, basically, <laughs> what we do is we put. <laughs> Go ahead. What were you saying? No, we put it on the story. What's that, Mike? See on the story, then they will on on the actual picture. But because but, but, there's already one post on there, if you put the same post every day, no one's gonna see it. The yeah, but you, you, but that you, you got to be creative as a creative. I know, but it, it looks like up. an ad. On yeah. your on your on your actual oh. feed, yeah, it doesn't want to show it to people because you're not paying for that ad. That's part of the algorithm. 
whatever. Whatever you got to do to shut. What's up? What, what I'm going to look at you to have me sell more CDs. Yeah. And I don't have to. So you're, you're blaming Mike for your okay. CD sales. And what everything. you also want is more people oh. just to stream it because you're going to make more money off of that than you will. Yeah, that's what I mean. Streaming it yeah. on iTunes. They, they download it. I don't, I'm not saying that you're coming to my house and buying it. I'm not opening a fucking no. CD stand. No, no. What I mean is they're, they have Apple Music or Spotify. Yeah, they're not buying not, the entire CD. You have 19,000 people following you on Instagram. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I have a hundred thousand, eighty on some Twitter. Or You've got one, two, uh, three things on story. Yes, your story should be fuller. He is failing you. He is <laughs> at, a, at an alarming rate. You're yeah. doing his social media. I mean, t- yeah, it's not terrible. helping me. You're doing it. I pay you. Yeah. yeah no. No. He's, he's literally. I would scream at him right now. I don't want to because I like him. <laughs> I like him too, but I would fucking. Kill him. Like the fact that he kill didn't him. get something downstairs when he saw you or something from me. Hey, can you do something for Voss's to tell people? The, I mean, you got to be thinking all the time about the story. Hey, Voss is a C. Bobby punches CD. Hey, Soda, did you hear about Voss's? Can you do something? Yeah, he should be getting stuff all like that. Stuff, you right? should too, though. I know. He, but I, you I, should, I do a I'm lot. Lazy. Mike, I do a lot on my story. Yes. Now, yes. Look at the poor guy sweating like a fucking suckling pig. I don't look at it. <laughs> I mean, yeah, no, he's, I, I you know. do so much. Why don't you put that on your, on my story, your forehead <laughs> dripping <laughs> dripping like a tornado? What if, just, what if it's just drip the name of your album right on his forehead? That'd it's be like, perfect. I mean, he's going to have a, I mean, I think he's dying. <laughs> Nobody's sweating in here. <laughs> Nobody. Nobody's sweating. And that, fo- I mean, I'm going to throw up. It looks like wet ham. I'll give you five bucks. It looks like I'll high school ham. 20 bucks to go lick his forehead. How much? Lick that 20. Lick you, his forehead. You give me 300, I'll do it. No way. Three, give me one of those rings, I'll do it. No way. Or 300. Same no. price. It's not the same. I know it's not. Oh, boy. You th- well, you're doing impressions again. I'm That's glad you're not you. Back. No, that was an original. Oh, that was? Yeah, that was a good one. That was original. Which, are these candies good or spiked? <laughs> First of Fight. all, it's illegal Fight. to. What do you think? I'm Ari Shafir? Yeah. I'm putting mushrooms Molly. in candy. Oh, no, he sells out. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> I sold out this weekend. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Uh, what, a 14 seater? Dude, no, I heard comedy on state, dude. Oh, yeah. Well, what you do you mean, oh, yeah? First of all, you weren't there this week, and you were in Aruba. Last week. Last uh, week. So I'm, did I the same week. But You didn't my, sell out in Comedy on State? No. I, yes, I did there. I mean, any, everybody sells out there. No, it's, it's a true. What you sell out? You mean your material or the seats? <laughs> Eat one of those so I know they're good. I can't. I'm on this. Yeah. I'm on a, what am I on, Mike? I'll do it. Yeah, I'll Go ahead. Do it. Do it. it. Not that one, not that one, not that one. No, don't put that down. (laughs) That one's for you. No. (laughs) No. Why would you think in a million fucking years? This is why you are nuts. This is why Here, you're both. fucking mental. I don't know. I know your no, fingers I'm, are all over. Oh, yeah. God. I mean, I disagree. Yeah, so you, yeah. you got. Guy took a fucking train and a bus to get here. I know. And then he's touching <laughs> your chocolate. <laughs> he, him he shows up like Bill Bixby with a backpack. Hey. <laughs> he's rubbing it I like sleep a here tonight? And he, he has water in his bag because he has to have it. <laughs> Never know when I'm going to be home again. <laughs> um, <laughs> I would, why would I ever? This is what fucking bugs me about you. Okay, tell me. It tastes tell like Tell me. Go ahead, Bonnie. <laughs> <laughs> I left home so I didn't have to hear this. But what the hell? Listen, it's two bees it, coming at it me. It bugs me about you is that you think that there'd be chocolate <laughs> on the fucking table. Yeah, like thirty-eight. Yeah, uh, and I would just dose them. Not you dose them. First of all, comics bring stuff around. Who knows? It was <laughs> sealed. It's good. Yeah, it was sealed. Yeah, good. So what are you gonna uh, do? Watch me for the next eighteen minutes to find out if I take uh, hopefully sweat not. like. Fucking wet no, 18 minutes. <laughs> maybe seven I'd watch you for. Yeah. <laughs> if oh, I was shit. a TV producer. If you want to learn something. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, I like that. That was good. <laughs> Whoa, look who's... Look at this. All the mics are coming on strong tonight. Yeah. Uh, Fiona and Mush. Uh, Fenoya. Yeah. Fenoya. I always say it wrong. Yeah. Why does he Fiona? say that? Everyone does. Yeah, what? it's a shitty name. It is. What are you it's a do? hard name, dude. It's not. I'll hard. tell you what you do. Change it. To what? Yeah. Now? <laughs> Kelly. Change it to Mike Change Kelly. To, Mike Kelly? To Mike yeah, we'll tour together. Or Why to not? Mike, I quit. Yeah. <laughs> I should. Mike, I uh, quit? <laughs> I should just change it to that. He did a horrible one. Uh, last year, we did a, a private show at uh, some uh, oh, acidic uh, uh, party. It was Horrific! I'm watching him eat it. Going, oh, at least thank God he's eating, it. and they'll turn around for me. Uh, what he ate, regurgitated, and I ate it. it <laughs> oh, you both ate your dicks. Oh, oh it was fucking terrible. Fucking Where was it? 
He well, brought me to some, what was it, like in Brooklyn? Brooklyn, right. Yeah, Brooklyn. The part of Brooklyn that's impossible to get to, like right next to the river. There, no trains go there. There's a river in Brooklyn? Well, you know, uh, the, the East, East River. river goes between Manhattan and Brooklyn. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Underneath uh, one of the bridges. <laughs> I, didn't, I, I didn't know. Dumbo? I, I, oh, yeah, yeah, Dumbo. Oh, okay. And it was What'd you call party. me? <laughs> I just didn't know that you river. Didn't say Dingbat, <laughs> Dingbat, Brooklyn. Well, you know the difference between a D and a J. Yeah, yeah I do. You're a J. <laughs> 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 There's guys rolling cigars the whole time. Remember that? Yeah. You're a D and a J. You're, You're a dumb, dumb Jew. <laughs> <laughs> hey, DJ Boss. <laughs> Um, I want to change. Yeah, it was name. a horrible. It was it's a not horrible. that hard. To, Dumbo is not hard to get to. The train goes right there. The J train, the really? J train literally stops. The J stop stops right there. It does. Yeah, you walk. How do you know all about trains? Because in I've done television and we shot over there. Oh, and I had to take the train because I wasn't famous. <laughs> so they made me take <laughs> a mean, train. <laughs> wasn't wasn't still aren't. Don't say you wasn't famous at the time. You know, I mean, you're well known. You know, in this room. <laughs> You're the second most famous. You're not the first. Oh, easily. Bubba, I guarantee Chris has no idea who you are. <laughs> <laughs> I guarantee he forgot you. Uh, Chris, what's Voss's last name? Uh, I, I, <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. It was. Thanks. I hope you're working on my story. <laughs> yeah, he is. You're, you're amazing at it. You do so much with Instagram. I hate it. I absolutely hate it. I don't understand what you mean. You're on your story. Yeah, yeah, you yeah, put yeah, a ton of stories on. Yeah, talk more. Go ahead. How great. <laughs> <laughs> you got the new puppy. I watched that. Can I say something about the story, though? I, I don't do Twitter at all. Yeah. Why? I think because it's negative. It's garbage. It's for people. Oh, there's a lot of Here's people. what it is it's for, okay, great joke writers or people who like writing jokes on it, and then, oh, that's a good one. Let me put it out there, and let me see how many people like my joke. I get it. Mm. I actually do that on stage on weekends, yeah. but you can do it <laughs> during the week just yeah. to get your dick hard and have a bunch of hearts. I get it. I cool. actually go Instagram because I like I like videos, I like photos, and I, I, I like when people, I let them kind of into my world of what I'm doing in that day. That's why the stories are great. They go the fuck away. Yep. Um, so, yeah, I like that. That medium is kind of like a, a longer vine for me, which right. I like. I think Instagram is the best. I, I, I think it's great. It's not self-serving. I'm not fucking being an egomaniac. I'm not sitting there going, look at me. I'm the fucking, sm look how funny I am. I'm actually being a little uh, vulnerable on there, which I think people like. Some yeah. people do. Some people don't. Whatever. Well, like when you're living an experience, like when you're with your kid, you're showing your kid the puppy for the first time. Do right. you go, this would be a great video? Well, like, I sit, do you think that? I, I sit. Well, I do videos not for story. I'm just doing videos. Right. And then I'll throw them on my story. Well, I'm, not really, I, I'm not really all the time going, let me flip on Instagram and oh. do a story. No, but you Sometimes want to archive I do. For a video of you and your kid. You yeah, some, I do yeah. a lot of video. Yes. Um, my kid likes it. I like I like video. I like editing it. I love the iPhone. I've always yeah. I've I like tech. I just love it. Yeah. So yeah, that type of video stuff is up my alley. People, there's people that are like uh, great on fucking yeah. Twitter. I mean, yeah. I read their tweets. I'm like, that's a fucking great tweet. You know, you got your own alley, huh? You got your own alley. What do you mean? You just set up my alley. I didn't know you had an alley. Wow. I wish you were dead in an alley. <laughs> 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 Yeah, but like, like, but I still get help with it. I, like, Mike helps me with that shit. Gabby helps with the Instagram. You have stuff. to. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, I like Gabby's. Mike's. My, Mike's is. I you know, Mike, it. you don't really do yours that much, but I do my own because I work with everybody else. Yeah, you should. That's the way it is. Keep look at me. You don't fucking make me feel guilty for you. No, no. I'm trying to. <laughs> I don't know. Well, no, I'm kidding. You can I make good money time. doing it, man. Huh? A lot of people charge a ton. I know, he, he but I think even on like Creeps with Kids, the stuff we and him were doing was fucking awesome. Yeah, very so good. Yeah, all the videos we were making. Videos are great. Watching you guys on tour. Yeah. It's a blast. Here's the thing why I loved our tour. Some people, it, look, I get it. You have a lot of money. You want to show us how much fucking money you get and mm. turn around and do that. Fucking, we're sold out. <laughs> hey, uh, what's up? It's just me. On, no, it's thousands of people. Yeah. I get it. Right. I get I'm it. jealous yeah, of say, it. Say thank you, Rogan. I'm je but, <laughs> well, whatever. I'm jealous of it. Absolutely, and if it, I could get it, I'd fucking, I definitely get it. Yes, but like you know, our thing. I think we were being funny all right. the time. We were, we're having, having fun. We were yes. showing. I wanted to not sit there and go, "Look at us selling out." Right. We're in a fuck because we didn't have a bus. We didn't have a jet. We didn't have a. We didn't have shit. No, we we, 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 we were all go. We drove in my fucking <laughs> truck once. Yeah. I mean, we were just going. We right. were making selling out. Yeah. Doing great, Kelly, but and here's the thing, 
not one. We did, I don't know, what, 16 theaters, 14? Over. Killed every show killer. Yeah, we mm-hmm. killed it. But here's the thing is that all the video, the content we put up was fun and interesting and behind right. the scenes. Yeah. Which I like. It yeah. wasn't us, you know, being uh, like, we're rock star. We're fucking Pantera. <laughs> right. <We're>, yeah. <laughs> I had even, to pick an old fucking band. Yeah. Even besides <laughs> me. It's Florentines. Like, not me, you know, besides me, the other three weak links even sure. killed it yeah. and held it together. Even Ronnie, <laughs> we Ronnie is a Ronnie's beast. amazing a dude. Beast. I love that I even know that dude. He's the best. He, this is a weird thing about Ronnie is that he has that thing where you want him to like you, yeah, and you want and you feel grateful to be friends with him. Uh huh. I was. But it's not enough. I was talking. Oh, no, never. He <laughs> never gives you enough. No. I was like, I get too much day. of this guy. Yeah. Like, I really, at some yeah. point, it's like, I'm dying enough. I don't want to. I'm full of all. He called me for over a week. I was broken. But, uh, <laughs> <laughs> so I was at serious the other morning. I was like, Bonnie, what's wrong? You're moping around. I go, stop. Uh, but, uh, I was at serious the other morning, yeah. and I'm talking to Ronnie. And as I'm talking, he's just walking to the elevator. I'm like, I'm really not done. He like, just walks I away. Just yeah, going. Totally. He, yeah, I think he's at a point where it's he's just that. Like I've, I've literally have conversations with him, and I'm like, wow, that was really meaningful. And I was like, yeah, because when my stepdad and he's gone, gone. like, yeah. gone. I, I, I was about to cry. <laughs> yeah, he, yeah. he gives you what he wants to give you, and then he walks away. That's why you want him. That's more. exactly. He keeps you wanting yeah. more. Yeah, I, but he is. A, he's an unbelievable. You know, it's funny too is how much he kills. Yeah. Nonchalantly. So chill. Yeah, dude. Yeah. Non fucking chalantly. Dude, he's the best at I mean I don't see it. <laughs> <laughs> Listening to his unmasked too. Like really? I remember going back and listening to like the old Brian Regan one yeah. from way back. And it's like this fucking guy, man. I could just listen to listen to him he's interview my fucking, dad about how much why he hates me so much. He, he, like, Arlen <laughs> and Newhart. He's done everybody. He's fucking major. Dude, I he's the only, I mean the reason why we do the thing at the end. He's because he's, he's there. Yeah, I wouldn't do it. I wouldn't. I, none of us would be able to do what he does at the end. Yeah, because he knows how to. Mm. He fine. <laughs> you don't. <laughs> it would be about you. You'd, it'd be all about you. You'd be like no. Fosbros dot com. <laughs> he literally guides us at the end and knows exactly yes. when to go. Guys, thank you so much. And he's so quick though, though with his comeback. Fast. He is quite quick. He makes us all look like superstars and he he knows when to But get he also it. knows right. how to fucking destroy us. Oh, really. he's destroyed me, man. That molestation <laughs> shit. Oh. I never said I was molested. All of a sudden they're like, "So when were you being molested, Bobby?" And I'm like, "I wasn't." <laughs> <Okay. laughs> well, you're like, "Was I? Is he that good of an interviewer that he like, "Was I fucking I was, molested?" I was. All right. And I told him a secret. <laughs> uh, into one of his two pairs of glasses. Yeah, it, it, oh, that's but, the funniest too. He goes on stage with two pairs who bears a class? If I did that, I'd be scared the whole time. That's a smart I wear a, a fucking shirt that's too tight. I'm like, I, they know I'm fat. I'm like, of course they do. But, uh, the guy walks on stage with two pairs of glasses, yeah. doesn't give a shit. And here's the thing about it nobody says anything. No. Never heard anybody call him fat. No. Never. No, I get called fat oh. all day long. <laughs> Come on, no, son. No. All day long. No, plus size, not always fat. No. I you lost athletic. weight already. I could tell you lost weight. I did not lose weight. You did on your diet. You I, could tell. I started it yesterday. <laughs> What's Amazing. the diet? What's the diet? You put Are, 90 he, dosed candies in front of you and no. just not eat them. No, he uses one. By the way, I'm feeling a little hard. fucking weird right now. Yeah, why? Ooh. Um, my hands are starting to like feel numb. I would stay away from, from the, the candy. candy. <laughs> I think there's something in it. He's ad libbing. <laughs> <laughs> I just want you to eat one and freak the fuck out. I um yeah, I, I was in that. Aruba, and I just I fucking I'm done. I, Why? I, I, Did somebody throw a harpoon at you? <laughs> <laughs> First of all, no, whaling's illegal. Good. Okay. Think... First of all, whaling's illegal. Okay. It's against the law. To do that? Yeah. Sea Shepherd took care of that. Unless you're in Japan or some shit. They can they can still hunt certain whales. Yeah. So the whaling jokes, I mean, upgrade them at least. <laughs> okay. Okay. All right. <laughs> Go ahead, I'm waiting. Sea urchin? No. They're not even that's that big. Small. They're tiny. They're small. Oh! <laughs> you just two out of Oh, you did a sick fart? Yeah, it's a oh, sick you fart, too. working you... out new stuff. Oh. oh. Sick farts are... You should only do sick farts oh. alone. Just medicine? Oh. oh, is it bad? You're an asshole. It's a matzo ball and fucking NyQuil fart. You... You're a fucking cunt. Oh, why would you... I don't usually get stingers like that. I wish You're I was fucking in the car dusty with my cold. wife. 
Wow. <laughs> 80 year old. I thought that sounds like a uh, singer. Dusty Colin. <laughs> <laughs> I was what are you doing today? I'm going to see Dusty Colin. <laughs> I found it on the plane home so bad from all this shit food I ate. Just chocolate and fucking french fries, pizzas. My asshole, it was the first of all, the shit was coming out black, like just tar. <laughs> And then I was farting on the plane so bad. My wife was getting mad at the person. She did. I, I was like, I kept looking around like, what the fuck? She was like, oh, I fucking whoever's doing that's a piece of shit. And she was so mad. And then we're walking to get the bags and she smelled it again. She goes, it was you. I'm like, how do you know it's me? She goes, the, there's no way I smelled it there. And now you're the only fucking thing that's still here. <laughs> Terrible. Nothing's better than ripping a sick fart when you're alone in bed and you just smell it until you fall back to sleep. <laughs> yeah, I think you know it's a I lot mean? better than that. I like jerking off as I'm smelling it. <laughs> you raise the fucking. <laughs> as I smell you're me. a fucking garbage person. You really are Jersey garbage. <laughs> right. You know that, right? Huh? You deserve the teeth you got in life. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> I pay for them. Not those ones. The oh. ones that are dead underneath those. Are they behind them? No, don't cough. Are, I don't want them implants. coming out. These are implants. You're just coughing and farting everywhere. That's what happens when you don't feel well. <laughs> well, I'm not Anywho. doing it everywhere. I'm doing it right where I'm sitting. The uh, oh, man. The uh, diet I'm on, uh, Tony V and actually Ray Ellen were doing this thing all week. They were eating fucking great, but they were on this diet. And I was like, I'm, I'm in. The, the whole 30. What's that? <laughs> it's the diet. <laughs> Why are you talking like an old man? What's that? <laughs> Put your headphones on, you fuck. I heard you. What's the whole 30? The whole 30? Ugh. Is it on ESPN? No. <laughs> it's a diet. <laughs> it's basically, look, and here's the thing. I treat diets like Bruce Lee treated martial arts. Okay, you take whatever you can do and put it together and just fucking do it. I know that grains are bad for me, and I know that sugars are bad, so I'm cutting them all the fuck out for 30 fucking days. I'm done. I'm done. 30 days, I'm done. I'm not... Oh. No, I'm talking no sugar, sugar though. I wish you were everything. I wish you were so saying hard. comedy. But go ahead. <laughs> Sorry. That was not good. What is it? <laughs> huh? He just did the pressure of you. What? Now we have to throw two mics away. Oh. Uh, that was a fake one, dummy. Huh? It was fake. He did it with his mouth. No, he didn't. Do it again. Oh, you're good. <laughs> that's why the impractical jokers like you. Yeah, buddy. You could do that. That's what I do. That's, that's what I'm. I, that's what I'm down to now. Just fart noises. <laughs> Post. You get me a job. <laughs> yeah, totally. Uh, how do you? <laughs> so gray sugar, is, you what? know, is the worst. Here's the thing. This is what got me on this diet. They were like, "You can have potatoes." I go, "Wait a minute. You can have breakfast with potatoes." I'm like, "What? Like, you have baked potatoes?" I'm like, "What?" Oh yeah. They're like, "You can have French fries." I'm like, "Get the fuck." You just can't put anything on it. Right. No, you can oil. Like I had a baked potato last night with virgin, extra, extra virgin olive oil, salt and pepper, or and mustard. an avocado. You can put I mustard. mushed it up. It was fucking or mustard. I had a I had a uh, hamburg steak with onions grilled in uh, virgin olive oil mm -hmm. with mustard instead of ketchup. It was actually I better. Wow. I liked it better. I I have mustard on my pierogies or mustard on so many things. Yeah, yeah, I, you know. But here, I put it on my, this is what's fucked up. This is why I like Instagram. I put it up there on Instagram. 60 people are doing it with me now. Nice. I mean, a bunch of people sent me thing. I'm fucking fat. I'm chubby. I'm sick of it. I'm fucked. And they were, I was like, let's go. And I sent everybody the stuff I got. So now everybody's going to do it for the next 30 days. That's well, cool. you don't know they're going to try. Well, I would assume. That guy, Kevin <laughs> Smith, the comic book guy, what? Kevin Smith, right? Well, he had he a bad heart attack. Yeah. And then no, he did a then, week of just potatoes. Well, yeah. you know how thin so, he is now? I know. Have Man, you seen he cut pictures? sugar. He just, that's all. What was your cut thought sugar. on the thing before I interrupt you? <laughs> Sorry. I know. Sorry. I, I thought you it. saw the picture I saw on like. He's super skinny now, but he ate a week, one week of all potatoes. <laughs> I hate you so bad. Did I cut him off? You, I mean, he was in the thing about the potatoes. What yeah, was oh, the scared the fuck out of me. Um, yeah, he ate a week of potatoes and lost a ton of weight. Like, reset, blood sugar went down a yeah. ton. Potatoes. White potatoes. Vegetable. Yep. Bang. You know what I got? Yeah, look at him now. Yeah. You know what I got? I got a f I got an air fryer. Yeah, I got one too. I love we it. Got Ninja. One. Did you the foodie? Yet? I never tried it. They're you great. Are, you're attacking me. I'll, you guys are both excited, and I love it. I Bonnie got me an air fryer. We never. What kind she get you? Uh, <laughs> I don't know. I never used it yet because huh? I don't cook. Um, what kind do you got? The foodie with an eye. Okay. And you can fit a six pound bird in it, and yeah. you can fit a, a ton of uh, potatoes. You put them in. Cooks quick. Everything tastes French fries. Great. French fries. Like they're fried. Yep. 
Wings. Little, you, you could do wings. Wings. You have one? Steak. Yeah. Oh, I didn't done steak yet. Put a steak in. It will cook it in 10 minutes. That's you have one of awesome. those? I just got That's one. That's the one I got on the left. The, the, that. Why are they good for losing weight? You use a lot less oil. Dude, you can like <clears throat> slice up a bunch of sweet potatoes, throw it in there, and you make like sweet potato chips. And yeah. it's all good. No, f- no. Sweet, I have sweet potato chips. Here's the thing, dude. I'm done. I'm done. Your wife was right. What did she say? She said, you suck and I should leave him. No, <laughs> no. she said, uh, you're unfunny. No, I'm kidding. She, you're funny. <laughs> she did say that. What did she say? She no. said, I don't like him. <laughs> she said, I Why thought he was going to not be you? like that always. <laughs> what? Why did she say that to me? <laughs> oh. My wife say, I hold my mouth and I cough. Yeah, sorry. do it into your elbow. Yeah, do it into your Now rain. you're going to shake everybody's hands. <laughs> yeah, oh, you're, I'm not. I'm yeah. not a fucking handshaker. Go my ahead. Hand. I go like that. I didn't shake it. I, I pounded you. We shook hands. I did? Yeah. Sorry. Uh, <laughs> I'm not <laughs> sick. I just have a little cough. Oh, what you're did my sick wife already. say? Who knows what you have? What um, did my wife say? I, I was joking. She didn't say anything. Oh, no, I'm saying your wife is right about <laughs> food, the way she eats. Oh. Of all the, and I, you know, I, I felt that way when I went to Belgium last year. The, it was actually not last summer, the summer before. Oh. And we ate like French fries <laughs> and we ate the food and I didn't feel bad. No. And I gained no weight. Because it was all yeah, it's not no processed lard. bullshit. Right. None. That's Nothing what I love in about it. About Belgium, that's all it is. Huh? That's what I love about Belgium. No processed food. You've never been. That's what you love about Belgium. I think I was. You've never been to Belgium. Is that real close to Holland? Because I did a one nighter in a. No. <laughs> yes, it is. It's not real close. I mean, I it's close as to the Holland Inn and <laughs> Wilkesbury. Can well, I, I did a Mike. Bel- how far is Holland, Mike? Right, what Voss's story? No, from the oh. previous episode. What? Okay. Oh, I love the way he controls me. <laughs> I like it. Holland from where? Like down. How far is Holland from Belgium? Or Holland from uh, Belgium. Amsterdam from Belgium. Anyways. Or Rotterdam, either one. Don't use Rotterdam. It's closer. Um, <laughs> <laughs> do, you, do you turn into a, like a fucking crackhead when you quit? Sugar. Dude, I when feel. You're freaking I, I, out? I felt yeah, sick I, I last night. Them. I've had a headache since I stopped. Splitting headache. No splitting what? headache. Do you caffeine. Do you do I'm th- drinking black coffee. Is that you don't normally drink black I, coffee? I drink coffee cream and agave or Splenda. Why don't you put uh, like what do you call it? almond milk or? I haven't. I haven't milk. gotten it yet, and it's hard to find. No. No. <laughs> Every supermarket. <laughs> Thanks, I don't Nana. An old Jewish no. Nana. No. No. You get it. Get it. You can get. I have it in my bag. Stocking. Okay, that's stuff called silk. You're silk. Yes, I am, baby. <laughs> no. Gross. Get that, uh, no, I'm sick. Uh, uh, is he doing the whole show? <laughs> so, <laughs> Tim doing that piece of shit well, how, like, was supposed to be in there, and he's helping us, saving us. I know, but like... He, 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 I didn't even know he was coming. He I didn't showed even finish up my soup. Yeah, so that thank you, Mike, for coming up. You're welcome. I had thank lentil you. soup earlier. That's that clock suck at Tim Dillon. And when am I coming on? Yeah. I'd like to come back on. Tell, oh, come on tomorrow. Okay, I'll see you tomorrow. Why? What's he got going on that he? He's probably fucking, patting a cat and just got done sucking a dick somewhere. It was my fault. Fucking Rosa canceled. Huh? It was my fault. I didn't. We didn't have his new number, and I thought we did. I should have uh, followed up. I don't know. Maybe I followed up and said, "Hey, bro, are you coming?" And he would have said, "No, nah, I can't make it. I was just talking shit last night." No, he. You know what I mean? On Instagram and said, uh, "What?" No one reminded me, and I said, "We didn't have your number," and I apologized to him. All right, so it's Mike's fault. My, uh, Tim, Did I he apologize. Did you get a new number? I texted in Tim one day. Yeah. Tim, I apologize for the cat reference. <laughs> <laughs> to be fair, he probably would have canceled anyway. But. Yeah. Oh, I like yeah. that. Oh. So, Rich, you were you were there, Rich? You were there. I went to. We did a one when I was doing uh, Holland. That's two. One night that. we did a one nighter in Belgium. We took the train there. So, yeah, I was in Belgium. That's yeah, too... Uh, yeah, it's not too far. Yeah, we did. Here's a funny... I rented a boat in Belgium to go up the canals for seven days. Uh-huh. So, we went from Newport to uh, Brussels on a Bruges. It took seven hours on the canal. And then we had to go back and take the train. It was 14 minutes. 14 minutes? Yeah, 14 uh, minutes. Seven okay. hours on the boat. <laughs> 14 minutes on the train. It was the fuck awesome. out of here. Swear the fucking fucking... No, I won't get the fuck out of here. That was a My cool studio. video, though. Huh? You made that video from the bow? Yeah, from oh, the awesome. bow. How do you know what a bow is? Like, I just ordered um, this he's thing. Not, he's never taken one. <laughs> 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 you don't do bows after guest spots. <laughs> Boss, that's why I love you and hate you. I knew as soon as you're, you hear the word bow, you're literally going, what other way can I say this? I knew it. <laughs> Oh, I shit my pants. <laughs> um, What's going on? I don't know. With that dumb hat, 
<laughs> what are you directing traffic in the snow squall? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, quite a squall out there. It is a squall. <laughs> I just ordered a cool. standard process. It's 21 days, and it's a, a organic, like raw food diet thing. Yeah. So you do seven days of no, like like the protein gets like lentils and shit. But you got to cut everything. Caffeine. Yep. And that's what's that's what kills me. Three yeah. days of that, I'm ready to. Fucking yeah, I'm not doing someone. that. Yeah, but and then I the fact that I get to eat a baked potato last night. That's that's killer. Saved my. I'll do that all the fucking day. And you can have breakfast potatoes. Mm-hmm. You can go into a fucking place and eat the breakfast potatoes. That's Avocados, great. eggs, bre- I'm in. The, about- pota- the, the, the thing is that, that kills me is that that homey, warmy, potato-y mm. motherfucker. Ooh, it feels good. <laughs> yeah. uh, what's the other potato, the Cuban potato they use? The uh, Cuban potato. Spanish guy. What do we got? The Cuban It's pot- called the yuca. Oh, yeah. You, we had that at the... How good is yuca? That's all right. I loved it. <laughs> and you it was loved good. it. What are you trying to be spicy? Are you just going left when I'm going right? Oh, yeah, yuca root. Rich. Yeah. Yeah, that was good. That yuca but, but you can't have butter. You can have ghee. I mean, which I, isn't we're, bad. We're, it we're, tastes the same. Huh? Ghee tastes the same. You just don't use as much of it. It's pretty sweet. Little ghee and I, or I'll use. I like extra virgin olive oil with salt and pepper. I put that on it. Lemon. I put that on my salad. I fucking eat it all day long. Yeah, you can't have butter. Long. Can't have butter. No dairy. No, no dairy. You know, I can't no cheese. Out, can't figure I, out how I, we would fish. ever be able to do intermittent fasting. Like as comics, it's impossible. Well, I tell you what, I I was trying to intermittent. Fucking, inter- my audience is slicing to, their wrists right now. Listen, <laughs> listen, I was tell try- us more, you fucking fat flabbing assholes. <laughs> listen, I was trying that diet. Well, so Tim I Dillon was, was eating here. from three three p.m. to eleven p.m. Right. So I'm walking down the street. It was two p.m. This is true. I'm starving. Right. And this homeless guy comes up to me. He goes, do you have a couple dollars so I can eat? I'm hungry. I go, you're hungry. I have another hour. <laughs> and I have money. <laughs> I go, try to go from 3 to 11, pal. Yeah, that's fucking crazy. Yeah, I had a guy say he was starving to, to me. And I, w- I went, I've been full for five years. <laughs> <laughs> How's that feel? How's that feel? I've never felt what you have in five years. Um, so how much are you going to kick on 30, in 30 days? I'm not, I don't care. Not about the way yeah. I, I'm changing. I'm gonna eat like this forever. I think, because here's the thing: the way we eat here and all the corn syrup and corn starch and all that bullshit in the foods, I don't like it. I don't fucking like it. And when I was on vacation this time, I wasn't me. I've been going to Aruba for a long time, and I've always had a blast. This year, physically, I just I felt like I was in somebody else's body. You know? Oh, I'm getting, sorry for them. <laughs> Meaning Fuck face <laughs> It's such a cunt. Excuse uh, me uh, Pay attention alright I'm Mrs. working all for the pot they, You're doing what? They do stuff They multitask While we're talking and enjoying ourselves If you're focusing on me She's putting stuff on Instagram He's doing stuff for your Instagram I mean it's all happening We got these guys over here Making sure everything's working I don't like her glow in the dark This guy over here is ready to jump in When one of us stinks Yeah She's too bright Her hat and her face What? You're not even listening to me I am No you were trying to find something wrong with her No I just too bright over there Every time I look over there I want to put on sunglasses Yeah the hat's stupid But we know why she does this She wants the peacock She's a peacocker What's a peacock? Gabby's a peacocker. A peacocker. It, uh, I'm already beautiful. I'm tall. I'm thin. I'm blonde. She's all right. I, and I'm going to do weird <laughs> shit just to fucking be weird because I can. That's what she's doing. She's got. Uh, she can always go back to. Yeah, awesome. she can always go back to being just a little awesome white fucking privileged girl. Let me be a little street rat. Let me look like a rat. Let me look like I own a skateboard <laughs> and a. Why metro is she park. sitting like a meth addict? Meth meth addict. Yeah, you know, like a. Can meth. you help him with that one? It's meth addict. <laughs> I said meth addict. You went. You went. went, A what? It's not cut. It's to. A meth addict. Addict? Addict. No, an addict is what you go and you put like old hats. We're bats. (laughs) Yeah, bats. Bats. That's why I was in my attic. Check this out. You want to hear a fucking bat story? Oh, no, because I'm scared, but go ahead. Oh, please. I got a video coming up. Oh, my God. Check this out. Go to patreon.com slash Robert Kelly for the video. See how I just did a story? I'm always working. Killing it. Bang. What? Um, Slow mo that end finger. You had a bat. I want you to Schultz that. Uh, <laughs> all right, Schultz this. You guys ready? Here we go. Um, I so me and Don rent. Last year we rented these four. They do these tours on the backside of Aruba, all desert. It's all desert. Yeah, ruins, 
caves, natural pool, all this great shit. But it's kind of dangerous. It's really windy on that side of the island because oh, the whole brutal. fucking uh, Pacific, I mean, uh, Atlantic Ocean is coming across. Yep. And it's hitting that side. The other side, well, all the hotels are calm as shit, beautiful, right? Yeah. So we rented a four wheel drive, a four wheel ATV last year, uh, four seater, so that Max sits up front, Don sits in back. I drive, and we fly. We're going over. It's crazy. It's awesome. A little dangerous. There was one point I was going down this hill, and they were like, "She was like, stop. We can't. Yeah. You're gonna kill us." And I had to turn around. <laughs> And uh, even Max was like, Dad, please don't hurt us. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, all right, all right. I had to add it. Was He's got like the cage and shit? Or no? Yep. Yeah. Nice. So we, uh, what are you doing? <laughs> now you got to eat those, you sick fuck. What are you doing? What are you doing? Now they're dosed. Why are you doing that? It's for work. Go ahead. What? You don't want to listen? I'm listening. Exactly. No, what'd you put in your ear? You won't put your headphones on, but you put stuff in your eyes? What is that? Why are you doing it's that? The Hershey You're kiss. like a fucking... <laughs> a, really? a, a shit kid in the special class. Yeah, you're like an okay dog. You can't pay attention. <laughs> <laughs> what do you call, what do you call me? What do you say? An okay dog. <laughs> <laughs> okay dog. Yeah, it means if if you got hit by a truck, be okay. he'd be okay with it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, oh, if, if you okay. stay if you stay around, fine. Yeah. But you're not gonna get you're not Whatever. getting a surgery. I'm not buying the expensive yeah, yeah. food. Oh, that's yeah. funny. Uh, yeah, if anything. If it, <laughs> If anything happens with you, you're going. <laughs> hey, we can do the surgery or we can put him to sleep. Yeah, I tell him I said bye. <laughs> that's, uh, that's called an okay dog? I guess. No, you I are. Just he just made it up, you deal, fucking you old bitches. asshole. Just let him have it. I'm asking, so no, I No, you're I like ripping it. it apart with your age. What's it called? <laughs> How'd you say it? What does it mean? Wow. Oh, I get it. That's a good one. Yeah, we laughed. We let him know yeah. that it was awesome. I complimented him. Name of the podcast. Okay, dog. You're an okay dog. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> so what happened with the four wheeler? <laughs> Hurry up before Nana nods uh, off again. <laughs> I know. On the back side of the island, there's caves. You didn't there's, go in the caves. Dude, check it out. There's one set of caves I really couldn't go into, if you know what I'm saying. Um, Small opening. No. <laughs> yeah, it's like most vaginas. Uh, uh, <laughs> thank you, Mike. Thank you, Chris, kind of. You do your job. I didn't think you'd get it because you're a hipster. Dumb hat. Um, <laughs> She's a fucking ass. There's one ca cave. You have to kind of walk up these <laughs> stairs, and you got to crouch down, and it comes down, and it opens up into this big cave with a hole in the ceiling where the sun literally comes through. Wow. Then you can go into these other caves, like crawl underneath no and, and other rooms. So we go in these caves. We we drive an hour and a half on the backside on the fucking flying, get there. We go in these caves. And uh, we'll crouch down. There's a couple other people in there. We're going in the back, like these little ones, into this other room. It's fucking dark as shit. I had to use my cell phone light. <coughs> All of a sudden, we're in the main room with a hole in the ceiling. It starts raining outside. Because mm -hmm. on the island, it rains like once a day. Comes starts coming through like a shower. It's beautiful. We're sitting there like, wow, this is fucking so... I can't believe we're here at this time. Yeah. And you can see the rain hitting the, the sand and... All of a sudden, Don goes, there's a bat. And oh, I was like, oh, my God. That's why I pushed my wife and kid and run. <laughs> we were like, oh, my God, that's crazy. There was one little bat. And then just where we came from, <gasps> above us, as we walked under there, was all bats. Uh, and we didn't know. They were in these little holes. They're all you're above just under him the whole time. So, <laughs> so all of a sudden, the, Don goes, there's another bat. There's no she goes, there's nine bats. <laughs> <laughs> We're like, fuck. The rain is coming through and the noise is making the bats go fuck. Uh, so they stack up. <laughs> so then no. so then it's like, oh shit. I look at the door. Now from where we are in this open area to the door, you can see the light of the door, but from here to there, it's pitch dark, all bats above you. We didn't know. So I look and it looks like just a flock of birds flying out the door. <laughs> so all these things are flying. From here to, like, it's got to be 50 yards. <laughs> so Dawn, and we're in this room, and there's, they're coming out there. So Dawn's like, I'm like, we got to go. And I was just like, look, I'm the, I had to say it. I go, I'm the man of the family right now. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to lead us, right? And you're talking just right to yourself. I'm talking to myself. It, yeah. I go, Max, daddy's going to swear 
but it's okay for now. And I'm walking on fuck, motherfuck shit. <laughs> shit, fuck, 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 fuck. Because as we're going, there's fucking hundreds of these Holy things. shit. And we got to make it, and Max starts flipping. Don hates bats. Everybody does. I, I don't yeah. mind them, but I didn't like this many bats. <laughs> and we're going through the, and I'm just going, fuck, 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 fuck. And we make it, we finally make it to the end. And I'm like, run, run. And but why didn't you wait till they went out? Because, dude, they were coming out behind us. Oh, they were coming from... They were coming from Yeah, in the opposite directions, it's just more cave, right? You just yeah, the other way is just dark cave. And they were coming from there, too. They were coming more from cave, there. More bats. It's nuts. It, it, was, it was just time to go. And Donnie hates bats. Max, They're the scariest things on the planet. Buddy. My, when we had our house in Connecticut, I heard a noise in the ceiling, and I called a guy, and I had him come look, and he goes, you got to come upstairs and look at this. And he lifted up the insulation... And we had like a hundred bats no. in the fucking underneath yeah. the insulation. I looked down. I'm like, start packing. I go, we're fucking. I'm not staying here. Really? No. Yeah. And they said they live underneath in the cold. It's like cool under there. And then yeah. at night they go out eat the mosquitoes. My neighbor yeah. goes, yeah, I saw a bunch flying out underneath, like where the siding meets whatever. So this guy goes, I'll take care of it. It was like a thousand bucks. He had to put, like, sealed up the gap and let one way out. So they they got out, and then he put a mirror thing where they couldn't figure out how to get back in. And I go, where do they go? And he goes, they just go in your neighbor's attic. <laughs> and he went over and put a card in their door, and right. now their house was fucking infested with bats. I bet they're his pet bats. I bet they are. I bet every Christmas, <laughs> years ago, all the bats come home. <laughs> hey, Dad. But I every have, night they fly home. I don't think I have insulation up in my attic. We had insulation in our, yeah. between. I don't think I have any between my rafters. It was on the, on the floor. You should put some. Because yeah. you're gonna lose a the lot. Big of Big Ray's in Ranch, and it had like yeah. wide open. We ran like uh, ducked for Central Air, but it was yeah. crazy. I'd never seen anything like. You it. know, in New Hampshire, uh, maybe in Hampshire, you can't ca you can't do anything about it. You have to put a bat house outside of your home on a tree, and let, let them, them go. You there? can't fuck with them. This like some had, places, you can't kill them. Yeah, this guy had weird. We had skunks in the yard, yeah. and he captured them. And he said, "What he would do he is what captured them." <laughs> <laughs> what is that? A, is, that got, a, is that a Spanish? <laughs> Capture? Yeah. What is that? I got stuck Except between caught it. and captured. I said capture. <laughs> wait. Oh my God. These, these fucking candies are kicking in. Hang on, wait. What kind of bat? What do you mean? You <laughs> like they're protected? Bats are protected? Yeah. They yeah, eat you, mosquitoes. Okay. Yeah, you can't. They're kill like them. actually good for in the wild. They're great in your attic or in a cave Dude, with your family. In, in a Scooby Doo episode, they're off. Yeah, if they the, bite you, you're gonna get raped. In the seventies, your uncle would just go up there and with a flamethrower and burn them all. Honestly, yeah, yeah, yeah just. Yeah. My dad yeah. used to throw like a steak dipped in Drano, like yeah. in the trash. To Back kill in the day, food. they used yeah, to kill them. Fucking... Oh. What's happening is people just kill shit. Yeah, we just kill it, and it's just then it's like oh, it's, we have like eight left. Yeah, you just hit it. With <laughs> you see a and, a, and the mosquitoes are fucking everywhere. That's a great for bugs. Mm -hmm. Like spiders. Spiders are great for insects. If you have spiders in your garden, it's good. I have them in the house. But if I, I see one, I'm spiders in the house. I'd kill them. What are you hmm. crazy? I don't kill any animal. What? Any insect? I think Why? Outside. Why would I kill it? No audiences. Anything? I would take no. it outside. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, he's out of control tonight. Why, I, uh, why can't, well, I don't understand that. Why is he out of control? I, I bring that on people sometimes because they, <laughs> they always want to go after the fucking the, the king. You know, they, right. princes, you know, if you're a prince, you always want to be a king. Or at well, least, that's nice. He called you a prince. That's very nice of you. I, Thank I, you, I you king. Princess. <laughs> if, yeah, <laughs> but, what am I? Huh? What am I then? You're the bishop. <laughs> Fuck off! I'm not a bishop. <laughs> you're a dumb hat. No, uh, you're not a bishop. Stupid She's a bishop. Cloak. <laughs> She's a bishop. <laughs> you're uh, you're you're an emperor. She's just a bish. You're an emperor. is <laughs> nice. You're an emperor. I'll take emperor. That's above you. Because we're like in your dojo. Well, no, in, in, we're in different places. I'm a king, but you're an emperor. In your place, you're top notch. In mine, I'm top notch. All right. So, well, wow. I'm an emperor. I'll take emperor. Is that because yeah. I look like Buddha? No, he wasn't oh. an emperor. He was a fucking god. god. I'll take god. You're not, no, you're an emperor. All right. <laughs> emperor is pretty nice. cool. That's fine. So, yeah. He's a, he's a, what? a pawn stone. <laughs> what? <laughs> he's a commoner. Just a pawn. You don't have to. A pawn <laughs> scum? Stone. Stone. Yeah. <laughs> Why? I just bought a fake stone to put over my. Uh, <laughs> you fake keys? Your keys? Over, no, the, what do you call it? We have Your a well. Head? <laughs> 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 you have a well. Yeah. You have a real well? A well. Like, <laughs> no, you have like a well like a, like with a thing and you, you get water out of it? A bucket? No, no, no. We don't have that kind of well. Is it full of snakes and shit? <laughs> I know. No, we have a well. That's how we get our water in my house. Right. Well. Most people get their water from a well. What? Oh, really? Out in the country? Oh. Yeah. 
Where the fuck you? You have to drill down, and it, actually, when you get like a house in the woods, like New Hampshire, when you yeah. buy land, they have to come in and drill a well, and it, you get charged on the um, how deep it goes. You, but you're not in the. You're that far out. No, we're in the same town, but I guess well, back he, in the day, he's out there. Yeah. Back in the day, you know, mm-hmm. that's how most. You know, there was far, a lot of farms out where I lived back in the day, and that's. Probably how they got their water. I'm so fucking so. sick of living in this city. I want to get Wait, out. Wait, do you guys? Are you living with your wife again? Nope. Wait. Nope. She's still. We're no. We're we're uh, we've been talking about it. We, I talk to you about it all the time. Yeah. I think we're gonna uh, in about a year. I think and move, move back year, together. We're gonna live together. Somewhere Where in between? Oh, uh, like maybe but around. You, but you're not in Connecticut anymore. No, I'm in Queens. No, but she's not in Connecticut. Yeah, she's up there. Where in she's Stanford? There. No, like New Havenish area, like up that way. That's it's a great. hall. The other night, it took me an hour and 10 minutes, no traffic, hour and 20, and then, it tra- man, three and a half hours other days, you know? Yeah, it's, it's cra- fucking it's crazy. crazy. Uh, yeah. Connecticut is the worst. It's fucking terrible. Connecticut and Long Island, driving on either one of them. But just different. living here, man, I mean, it's like, I have a car here, and it's like, I'm just, I'm, st- I'm fucked. I either, I, I get $90 in tickets a week, or I have to go sit out in my car from 8 o'clock till 10 in the morning. It's no. disgusting. It's awful. And if, Queens is like that. Yeah, it's brutal. You can't find like every. Isn't there all, alternate? Yeah, but it's alternate side of the street. Why parking? would you not let him try to say that? <laughs> <laughs> I felt bad at the holidays. To, what is it? Alternate side of the street parking. It's fu- it's it's even better listening <laughs> to you when you're sick. Say it again, real quick, right now. Go. Side of the street parking. No, say it the other way. <laughs> you now. say it quick. Go. I say, say it all. Alternate side of the street parking. What? <laughs> <laughs> what? Skip the unnecessary. Stuff. That's going to be my other than story. Than... No, no <laughs> that's my story. <laughs> to me, widehead. <laughs> Only good stories. Yeah, you <laughs> call him Widehead. <laughs> oh my god, because he's not fits. really big, but it's wide. He really does. He looks like a fucking undiscovered animal. <laughs> <laughs> I'm surprised you didn't see him in the cave. Like you'd have to wonder if he's poisonous. <laughs> Richard's just undiscovered. Oh. Oh, he's not discovered. He said, Rich is just undiscovered. Oh. That was pretty that. good. That's not bad. That's really good. That's, That's not was bad. Good. He won't go after. Oh. He won't oh, Chris likes it, too. Oh. Who is Little this guy? Benito. Ben- What's up, man? How are you? What'd you call him? I- Benito what? Del Torio. <laughs> no. Del Toro. Del Toro. <laughs> nope. What is it? Benicio Del Toro. That's what I said. What'd That's, you say? Not even close. I said Benicio you know Del Benito. Toro. Benito. You call them Benito <laughs> Del Toro. Another guy. Who are you talking about? I, I thought Benito was correct. Also, he's a Benito. <laughs> what are you? Who are you talking about? The actor. I'm I, a, I hate you. Talk about <laughs> a, a guy that lives on my block. Why does your hair look sick? <laughs> I know. I, I didn't do it. I got to put my hat on. Oh please. <laughs> <laughs> you got the flu shot though. You said right. What do you got? Yeah. Nothing. Just a sore. I hope it's AIDS. <laughs> oh, just a cough. Um, yeah, we're gonna. We're gonna live together somewhere in between. That's I'm good. sick of this. Well, if you city. people don't understand that where I live, Westchester, you don't have kids, right? No, you're not gonna have kids. No, you guys can move to New Rochelle. You can move to all those little towns up there for cheap as shit, no taxes, because you don't have to worry about the school district. Right. Okay. So you can get a sick house, mm-hmm. a fucking sick house for what? What are you paying rent? Fifteen hundred in Queens, like sixteen. But dude, you could get. A fucking mortgage. My mortgage is and almost is two thousand. I know four hundred more right? for a yard. And you're a well. literally making my point without me letting me make it. Yeah, because you're getting a little greedy today. <laughs> <laughs> right, well, you might be right. You, you know, it is pretty. Drop those. It is pretty nice not living with your uh, with your wife though. Why? It is because you. Ow! Oh! Oh what? Oh, my finger got caught. In oh, it the- makes me so happy. Oh, <laughs> Nana. Oh, that makes me so happy. Somebody get Nana some ice. Uh, oh. Pinched your little hands. Oh, my little. <laughs> your little fucking oh. weird hands. Your little golfing hands. Zach just took a dump. <laughs> I bet he yeah. takes a fucking gross dump. Yeah. yeah. His dump has a beard on it. <laughs> so does not <it> Bonnie's. <laughs> <laughs> I get it. Okay, good. <laughs> you guys have baby wipes in there? No. Oh. I travel with them. Yeah, yeah but, but you sure. can't flush them. Yeah, you can. Yes, you can. You flush the flush ones. baby wipes. What are you talking about? The can about? do's with the frog on it, you can flush them. Oh, really? Yep. Yeah. I didn't know that. I have to carry them around. Anyways, back to you. It's great living with Living up there. Yeah. F- dude, you're in the city in fucking 30 minutes. I know. I Train, know. <sighs> two seconds. Grand Central, you could go home any night. Yeah. You could Uber home if you had to in a jam. Is Port Chester okay. a dump? Yep. Yeah. But <laughs> I'll tell you what, it's got great restaurants. It's on its way up. 
You guys don't have kids, so it doesn't matter. So for you, it's not. Downtown Port Chester, they have one of the best taco places I've ever been to. There's another restaurant over there. It's it's like coming up. It's yeah. really cool. And you could get a nice little house over there on the water, near the wall. Fuck. Dude, yeah. Yeah. I like to live a little more inward because I like having options. I like having the sawmill in 87. You guys could get an apartment in fucking Terrytown or apartment uh, of here's Irvington. The, here's the mayor of Port Chester right here. Oh, Richie Falanca. But yeah. You um <laughs> what's the other place? Uh, Dobbs Ferry. Uh-huh. Right in the downtown, you get an apartment. Yeah. Downtown. I would and, like a yard if I'm going to live out if I'm going to be out Yeah, why would you get an apartment? Get a house. Get a fenced in yard, there's a nice yard, part, couple dogs. Let them nice part around. of Yonkers. There's a shitty part of Yonkers, but there's also a really nice part that you get a cheap house in. Well, cuz the school district garbage so it doesn't matter to you. Yeah, I got to stay close to Connecticut so she can get to work and back, you know? Because uh, yeah. she's got the reverse commute. <coughs> Port Chester, but still, right. Port Chester. Or uh, even like, yeah, that Westchester area. Yeah, you Mamaronet, there. Armonk. Yeah, it's nice. not bad. Yeah, really nice. Yeah. Because Connecticut, the southern part of Connecticut's untouchably expensive. Untouchably. Untouchably expensive. Untouchably. I tried to the, sound as Connecticut as I could there. <laughs> One of the greatest right. days in my life when my a lot of anxiety left my life was when I pulled into my driveway. And I got out of my car with the windows down and the keys inside and it went in my house. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Look at That's it, stretch. You don't have to. Yeah. You know? Yeah. This place stinks. I hate I hate paying fucking rent. Like I'll never like you lease. I would never lease a car. I won't I won't. We pay just rent bought again. my wife's car. Oh, you bought it? Yesterday. Good. Uh it's just it's just throwing money out the fucking window. I know. It really is. It's a tax write off. That's the one for my company. Yeah, my car is a tax write off. All the miles are a write off. So All the that, gas that's is a write off. Everybody's write off their no. cars. Yeah, no. if you're an entertainer. No, but if you own it, it's it's a one-time write-off. No, I write off every year mileage and gas. Yeah, but you can't write off the payment. So every yes. so every I get a tax write-off on that yeah. payment and the gas and all that shit every month. So it's I can if get If I buy a new car, I get to write it off. But you're not you're not hearing me. You're just yes, trying to no. debate me. And I want to win debate. something. I don't want to win. Bonnie says I always have to win. I don't have to win. Oh, you want to do you're actually doing a good job. <laughs> doing a good job. <laughs> you caught if that's, with, uh, if that's what your dreams are, you're doing Eight good. weeks ago, you would have been hey, still trying to win, but you hey, caught Mike, yourself. Hey, hey, Mike, she was going on with the impeachment. Oh, dude, yeah. dude, I can't. Who gives a shit? I don't care. I think it's. It's, it's all it's, garbage. It's all fun. The, if you watch the impeachment, it's because you like. It's like watching Deadliest Catch or Pawn Stars. Same shit. Mm-hmm. It's the same shit. They leave you at the commercial up next. It's all garbage. It's all fake. It's all horse shit. If you watch any of this garbage, it, and, and it's going to get Trump reelected. That's what it's going to do. It's going to get... Tr- so if you're trying... If you're watching this shit and buying into it, say hello to him for the next four fucking years. Why do you think it'll get him reelected? Because people are getting sick of it. People are getting sick but of the are- news. Let me finish. Yes. I don't want to get into politics. I'm not a politics guy. Neither am I. And I don't like talking it, but people are getting sick of it, and people are going to be like, you know what? Fuck you. Like someone said to me, I don't like Trump. I just hate them. Yeah, but you know what? So that's what people are saying. I don't like him, but I hate them because they're fucking... These people are manipulating me, and they think I'm stupid. They think I don't have common sense. They think that I'm buying into this shit, and all I see is propaganda, bullshit, fake news, all the shit that Trump's saying. Yeah, but he does. You're like, oh, my God, that is right. I don't like this fucking lunatic, but you're a fucking piece of shit, too. I like that Telsey Galber. I like her. I think she's pretty upfront, but they're trying to bury her every fucking second they can the problem. bury her. She's a goddamn veteran. Of, she went to war. And you fucking, they discredit her and disrespect her. You're a fucking piece of shit. Yeah, it's but there, there are also people also saying that, I mean, either way, who's ever in office, but they're saying about Trump too, like, he's a liar. He, of course he is. Word, but know, that's everything. what he's using. He's saying, yeah, <laughs> he's a fucking, he's he a does. reality TV star yeah. doing the mo- right. biggest reality TV ever. He knows exactly what he's doing. He's playing into all this bullshit because he's going to win. Because he he's a fucking Democrat that turned Republican because that's how he could win. And these fucking idiots are buying into his, we're going to yeah. be crazy too. Shut the fuck up yeah. and just put somebody in there that we can vote for. Well, that's yeah, the that's, problem. Who, stop, who do you, but who is that? They're going to have to, do they have to go celebrity at this point, right? No, they don't. Oh. They need to put well, some. But nobody out of these, they're all like fucking anemic. Like they can't fight his fight. You know I mean, what I mean? Stop, stop well, with, they, if, they're going to have. they get writers, they can. 
<laughs> if they get writers. Yeah, true. <laughs> That's all it's they hard. gotta do. It's just hard to it's, like it, that I, I like I like listening to that fucking Mayor Pete guy. I sure. Think. They're all yeah. awesome, but it's yeah. just they don't I don't see them They're going not head awesome. to head with They're all fucking morons. Every, you know, Richard every, Galaka. They're all politicians, man. Who? Yes. I like the guy. I like Ver, I like Vermin Supreme. You know who he is? The guy from New Hampshire with the boot on his head. You seen that guy? The guy. Look, right. Look up Vermin Supreme. He wears a uh, a a rain boot on his head, and he says if he gets elected, everyone will get a pony. <laughs> look, there he is. He's got the he's got a a, a boot on his head. Yeah, I vote yeah. for him every year. Uh-huh. That's how much I give a fuck about politics. They're all idiots. I mean, they're all crim- It's all big. It is. It's just business. And what big, it's big yeah. money, dude. It's what it they is, do. It's the what, you what do you got to do to keep you're your You're right. It's a reality running. TV show. That's, that's why people are like, well, Hillary Clinton. It's like she's the same shit, dude. Yeah. Big business, big money. They all make all millions. Is. Okay, so what about Fuck Bernie? Off. What about Bernie Sanders? Yeah, I know. What about Bernie? He's, he's big fucking, business he's too. Gonna, he's going to grab his chest, and who are we going to be left with? I know. So if if he gets, you know, they and and they fucked him last year. I think Bernie was onto something last year. Oh, not last year. The last time. Uh, three years ago, I think he was onto something because he was getting money from people. Right. All the money came not from government, not from big companies, not from the people, which set, spoke to me. Yeah. Spoke to a lot of people, and he wanted health care. Spoke to me. He wanted. I mean, there was things that I was like, "That's a little social. It's a little weird. I don't know if I want government controlling all." This. But whatever. He was actually looking good. Yep. And what did they do? What did CNN do? What did MSNBC? Do? They say like the Clintons better. Yeah, they I like, know. And, and they didn't and, let and, him. Be involved in anything. And they fucked him and they took away everything and they took away his votes and they didn't give him a shot. He could have fucking done it, I think, and he would have beat Trump, I think, more so than Hillary. I think so too. So I don't think he would have, I don't think he had the dirt in his closet that, uh, you know, Trump needs something to, you know, crooked Hillary, sleepy uh, Joe, fucking this one, that one. He just names everybody. You know what I mean? When it's a roast. When you're debating him, you might as well just say, yeah. I'm going into a roast. Right, the right. Does it, it fuck it. Who gives a shit? I know. It, but it's like, it, nah, it's he, all over anyway. Yeah, he's going to fucking win again. going to die. <laughs> I've been saying, I got a big fight with Joe about this a year ago. I remember that. I was, yeah. it was like, dude. Joe who, List? Yeah. Why is he, he, he's, a, he's a big Democrat, Elizabeth Warren and stuff. I was like, yeah. dude, all these people are doing all this phony shit. And contradict them and being hypocrites, and we're watching it. And most of us aren't stupid, and we're not. We're not politicians. We're not Harvard grads. We're not on the coasts. Right. With right. fucking these people are millionaires who don't give a fuck about anybody telling us what to do and what's right. Yeah, but same with the same with Trump. He doesn't give a fuck about it. They're, they're falling but, for but his you're bullshit. Not, see, this is the bullshit that what? people fall into. Yeah, but I'm not saying I, I'm. I'm not saying either or. They're both sides are fucking stupid. Why did you go to the hospital? <laughs> <laughs> this is how old you are. That's my holiday. My holiday and your Ruba bracelet. I forgot to take. Oh. <laughs> Dude, the uh, concern in your voice was beautiful, though. I know. I was worried. Yeah, let's Why did you go to the hospital, buddy? I just think, anywhere. I just think you should just fuck it. I don't know. Fucking stupidness. No, but I'll I tell you, you one thing. Please. He is, if he gets impeached. He's not he, getting impeached. He, I mean. He, not happening. If they it's bring a, a, if, it's even a sham. Not, but if. No, look. It, uh, you Clinton, have to understand. Clinton, it's didn't not get happening, Vaughn. No, I know he's not getting kicked it's, out. Of don't office. say if he gets anything. It's it's all bullshit. No, I know. It's all a scam to pe- make people not like him to think he's a criminal, which he is or isn't. I don't give a fuck. Whatever you say, but it's all horse shit to misdirect and to fucking put propaganda against him. And he does the same. It's it's stupid. They should just lay off of it. Go get go get people that are doing shit for us. Gonna get fucking health care or go get the things that we need, free colleges or something, figure it out and get us the fuck out of where the fuck we are and well, worry yeah, about us. My concern yeah. is health care. Yeah, me too, 20000 a year. $1,800 a month I have to Mine's pay. 2000 now. Okay. A month. That's because you're old. No, it's because when... <laughs> yeah, that <laughs> is, that's one of the reasons. It's and only going to get more expensive, too. It's cause, no, it's no. going up to 2000 this year from $1,800. Yeah. 2000 a month. That's... Do you know that's twenty four thousand? Some people don't make in a year. What that's I a have mortgage. To pay. Yeah, it's a fucking it's a mortgage. mortgage. My mortgage is two thousand one hundred. Uh, it's a mortgage. My health care is a mortgage. That's stupid. And you it? have to have it. You have to, especially if you have a kid. Especially if you're older. There's no possible way you can go without health insurance. I think that if who's supposed to make fucking two thousand dollars a month to just in case? Well, no, and not only that. You got to make four thousand. Like no, you got to make if you're uh, in your three thousand three hundred to make two thousand. Here's the deal. You see what I mean, right? After taxes. It, okay, but here's the deal. 
if you're in your mid 40s to 60s, you you have to pay two thousand dollars a month just in case. Yeah. If you're in your 60s and up, I get it. There's a lot of things go wrong. Blah blah. But from that time, that 15 years or 20 years or whatever the fuck it is, it's it's just in case you hurt hurt or break your leg. Blah blah. Your kid. It's a lot of fucking cash. It's, it's too insane. much. It's too much. And that's and that doesn't even count the fucking uh, the deductibles and the fucking. It's just so much of the insurance companies and the pharmaceutical companies. They're just running this fucking country. And like, too powerful. And like both of you ding dongs have kids. Do you think about college? Are you like putting away like I had thousands two kids of kids go to all, college? For, already, hang on, can we address him calling us ding dongs? Yeah, thank you. We're actually making a, a better wor- a world. <laughs> this fucking asshole didn't add anything to this planet. I know. Except his selfish dreams <laughs> of making it, which aren't going to happen. <laughs> yes. And, oh, and he's worried about, about his, you guys. He has a fucking about his parking tickets. He, <laughs> you're on my podcast. Car. I'm not on yours. Okay? <laughs> so here's the deal. You can and it's on my network, like. by the way. You can so, be on whenever you so like. listen. Here's the I meant deal. by being parents. Listen, cocksucker. Being a parent is the you want to. I know. No, I'm sorry. Being a parent is probably the only thing you can do to change the world. In my eyes. Well, no. Because yes, because my kid, if I raise him correctly, give him the right knowledge, mm-hmm. fuck college. I, I'm not going to okay. force my kid to do some scam. My kids no. are already oh. a genius if, without going to college. If you if you want to go to college, I'll help you. I think it's a scam if, too. If, I if, agree if you don't you. want to, fine, do whatever you want. But having a kid and raising them correctly is how you change the fucking world, right? Or it's break also, the chain of dysfunction in your family. Yeah. What's that? Or break the chain of dysfunction in which your changes the world. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Or he's a fucking nut. Yeah, but you, know, you don't. Yeah, but that's that's a very Who's small a percentage of people. I'm not. I'm not. Sure. No. I, look, I, I've thought about having a kid a million times. I, I would. Oh, you shouldn't. I, no. You shouldn't. But I, I mean, don't guys, think, like, no, I'll tell when, you what, I wouldn't be able to leave. When you start that. headlining, maybe think about. Oh, well, let me know when there's space. There's never going to be any. No, We're I, all done in this. I, I, I thought about being a dad a million times, but I'm just saying, like, how old are you? College tuition, forty. College tuition yeah. is like. Ah, fucking yeah, sixty grand don't? a year. Dude, no. are you, what I'm saying is, are you guys like putting, mo- paid already. putting money aside? For Two a- daughters of mine went to college. I paid a third. My ex-wife paid a third, and my kid paid a third. Uh, and they both went. My my kid went to East Carolina ECU, East Carolina University. My ex-wife lived in North Carolina, so she got in-state tuition. You, know, Michael, to- you don't have a kid. And worry about Base, worry about college tuition. Yeah, you have a kid because you want to be a parent. No, and you, you want, want somebody not, to raise. And you want leaves. you want to have uh, have a family. No, you I, don't have a kid and worry about. I didn't. You don't have a kid and worry about a house or a car. Yeah, or where it doesn't matter. You have. A There's kid. plenty of people that live in terrible places. And don't have a car and don't go to car, that raise beautiful, oh my God, children that add a shitload to the planet. Oh, yeah, totally. Or you so it it, it doesn't you. matter. I mean, I wasn't a- supposed to be here. My parents had me, and I'm, ha- I'm glad I'm here. I, they were 18. Right. I found out that my, my, my mom hid her pregnancy with me until she was like eight months pregnant. Right. She was in hairdressing school and would wear like my dad's huge t shirts. So my parents wouldn't say I was. I'm, I'm glad I'm here. Well, I my parents on your podcast on your uh, network. Well, my, my, <laughs> I like passive aggression. My, my parents. Fucking, one of my wife's <laughs> favorite tactics. I like that. That was my, very sneaky. My parents. I would love to be a parent. On their honeymoon, my that parents. Was so nice. On their honeymoon, went over a cliff down a hill, and their car headed to a lake, hit a tree, and they both went through the windshield on, on the hood, and. They should have been dead. Who? On their, my parents on their honeymoon. Are you kidding me? Yeah, no, they went over. Were you in her stomach at the time? No, no, because I was, no. It would have, was my sister was older, is older than me. Wow. But on their honeymoon. Your parents, like, did a fucking misery? <laughs> right off a cliff? Well, I down a hill. Well, why? Embankment. How did they, that happen? They probably lost control of the car. Was she blowing them? What was happening? Yeah. No, I'm honeymoon. My, no, my Fingering. mom gave bad head, so she probably. Won't. How do you know? How do you know that? That's what I heard. <laughs> no. From who? Huh? It was in From the eulogy. The neighbors. Like, son. <laughs> no. <laughs> Come here. I want to talk no, to they went through the fucking windshield. Both of them laying on the hood. <gasps> he was at the hardware store. Hey, come here for a second, for a kid. Second. You know your mom. <laughs> <laughs> Old toothy Voss. Old toothy. <laughs> that's, what, that's, what, that's what my dad told me. Too much teeth. <laughs> nah, dad, uh, we- so, you know, it's weird. Yeah. Like my first wife, she got pregnant. Yeah. Had a, a miscarriage. And then my 
other daughter was born, and then my other daughter after that. Yeah. So I had my two daughters. I would, if like the way life works, yeah. I wouldn't have had these kids I have now. Yeah. Right. It, who knows? But the, totally. his kids are great kids that are adding to. You know what I'm saying? I'm not saying if you don't have a kid, dude. I don't. I don't tell people like couples that don't have kids. As long as you're. Shouldn't even get married if you're not having a kid. I would adopt a kid, I think. For you can, if you can return it. Yeah, <laughs> totally. Yeah, I, I, I don't I don't I don't think people don't couples think who don't have kids, I don't I'm like cool. I'm cool with that. I just don't like people like fuck kids. Cause it's like kids, it's the best one of the best things that's yeah, ever I, happened I to me. People go, and I've done some good drugs. Yeah, you know what I mean? Sure, and I've partied sure. and I've done a lot of fucked up shit. But this part of my life has been some of the most connected fucking greatest times I've ever had because when you have a kid and you make that choice you can't help but be connected to family uh-huh. and it's but it, when it's yours there's something there's something that happens that fucks you up and makes you feel like real happiness mm-hmm. is like a, like excitement I never got that <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna go fuck my wife yeah. Well, what do you call? Uh, I, I hate when people go. I hate when people go. Oh, I'm not bringing a kid into this, onto this planet or this earth. Know. You know, that, that, that bullshit. Don't say blame the earth and the planet. No, that's what they say. Well, it's it's going to be gone. It's like, well, no, what if your kid gone. was the one that was going to solve it? Yeah. I doubt. What if your but, kid was the fucking next Elon Musk that was going to solve pollution and ozone? And what if that? And you fucked us all, you cocksucker. Just come in her and leave it. <laughs> Let the world decide. Well, fucking assholes. I'm not gonna bring a kitchen. Yeah, yeah, yeah I hate well, that one. This is our last YKWD of the year. So yeah. do you want to address that at all? Or I guess you want me to. Yeah, we should. You something. really fucking put the brakes on the whole kid yeah, thing. Jesus. Well, yeah, Jesus. I'm right. sorry that you're never gonna have oh. kids because your dog's gonna die. We're all gonna well, die. That's kinda rough. <laughs> what? <laughs> what the fuck? Does his dog got a die got it? Oh, he's I, got kidnapped. I don't have the ransom money. But your dog uh, got ki- what? No. Oh. What? No, we raised three grand for his dog. Remember no, we'll the tumor? Go get him. What's that? Last year, my dog's doing great. Remember his I dog? Know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We saved it. Yeah, I know. It's got a tumor in its neck. It's going to take him out probably this year, but we saved him for a year. How old's the dog? Uh, we found him when he was a little older, but he's doing good. No, he's doing good. We saved the dog. He probably has like five years left. Five years. Yeah, we saved him. He's going to die last year. That's amazing. This podcast. That I'm on, on your network. So, <laughs> let's let's save his career. Come on. Yeah. If it's going to take a lot club, more than a couple thousand dollars to do that. If you have a club. <laughs> this is why I love comedy. If you have a club with less than 30 <laughs> seats. Yeah. And Rich isn't already doing a weekend. Yeah. Yeah. Oh! But I get the door. <laughs> That's a good point. That's 30 right. times 30 is it's a lot of money. <laughs> money at yeah. How much is that? It's $900. It's $900. It's, it's pretty bad. good for a one nighter. Huh? Not bad. Uh, uh, thousand. I don't leave less than a thousand. Well, <laughs> yeah, I'm at the Philly punchline. <laughs> Sometimes <laughs> Anyways, 500. Yeah, it's, it, it is uh, the end of the year, 2020. No, 2019. 2000, uh, 2020 now. No, the end of the year is 2019. We're going into 2020. This will come out in 2019 still. Yeah, so you don't say the end of the year 2020. <laughs> you're fucking stupid. You That's why you're you stupid. You can't say it now. If I said it in June, you'd have a point dumb. No, face. you fucking moron. I'm saying it's 2020. It's going... It's You, you said it's the end of the year 2020. It's Without the end pausing. of the year. It's going to be 2020. I'm sorry. Okay, to put now up. we're fine. <laughs> <laughs> I hope you don't make it to 2020. Good. Whoa! Good. Whoa. <laughs> Decrease the surplus population. Oh, then I'll yeah? have a kid. I hope your diet fails and you do make it. <laughs> what? What? <laughs> Cough the other way. I know you. 2,020 pounds. We're all going to die up here. Uh, listen to me. I, we, we, have, we have headphones on. <laughs> we have no choice. 2019. That's all I have to do? Was it good How much year? does it bother you when you look over there? You see two bearded moes staring back at you. <laughs> 2019 was a good year. Yeah. Good year. Thanks. That's all you got? Well, no. Right, see, you next, see you next year on the YKWD. Well, people are kids, man. Yeah. Fuck off. Uh, it was a good year. We did, uh, Yeah. I mean... Uh, yeah. Business wise, we had a uh, uh, a very successful tour. Yes. Club wise, personally, uh, I bought a house, put out another CD, 
Uh, now, why did you put this CD out? I saw, I saw a hamburger. So no, What's when I called? saw Hamilton, <laughs> hamburger, yeah, <laughs> hamburger, hamburger. Why did when you? I what saw is, is it all about the day you saw Hamilton? No, I never saw it. But is it about? Oh, now we don't have it? to listen to no, the what, album. You want me to tell you what the fuck? I just don't get it. I'll you, tell you why you'd get it if you heard the album. I was fil- I was recording. I was recording at the brokerage. Yeah. So I know I'm going to record an album. Yeah. And I'm on stage, and some kid in the audience is filming me on his phone. I go, turn off your phone. I don't, you can't film me. Right. You know, what, it's just, and I said to Bouncer, throw him out, but then I let him slide. You know, I, I made a joke out of don't film. Then I go, you know what, come to think of it, I, I remember when I went to see Hamilton, I brought a three-camera crew in, and they got mad because I was filming them. I go, but aren't I allowed to film? Mm-hmm. And then throughout the... CD, I go, oh, yeah, when I saw Hamilton, I kept bringing that tag back in, in bits. So but it just, worked on stage. Right. I brought the tag back. So then I go, well, since I brought the tag in like three times, I'll call it when I saw Hamilton. Right. That's so crazy. there's no joke about you seeing Hamilton? No, not at all. I never saw it. I don't have that kind of money. <laughs> <laughs> I, saw, I saw Beetlejuice, but I didn't bring that up because I didn't yeah. see Beetlejuice till. I saw Beetlejuice. Recently. It was great. Yeah. It was I really liked, good. The lead, the guy in it is amazing. I love him. He's amazing. And you know, this guy, and the girl, the lead of Beetlejuice was the lead of uh, Schoolhouse Rock or one of the, that other one. Yes. Yeah, cool. And he has like. Stop acting like you're a theater buff. Okay, listen. Yeah, up. your legs got. You heard that. Listen, listen, it has no, it doesn't, means nothing to the story, adds nothing to the. And the theater. Just tell, and you're, just, yeah. you're just throwing in facts that you heard. No, it's School of yes. Rock. Yeah. School of Rock. Yeah. And a guy, you go to Instagram, he's got like 500 followers. He's a fucking amazing lead on Broadway yeah. in shows. Law- Broadway doesn't pay a lot of money. Uh, huh? It doesn't. The leaps, I'm sure he's making a good living. What'd you say? The lead is probably making the a leaps? Yeah, the I leaps. leaps. I didn't say leaps. <laughs> I heard a peer of being I think there. you said leaps. No, I didn't say leaps. Guaranteed. I didn't, this I is the funnest leaps. part about having you I on my- I said leads. Funnest part about having you do my podcast is that the people get to hit the 15 second button and go back and go, yep, he said leaps. No, yeah. I said, it's almost, I'll the, I what, call it the Voss game. I'll, be, I'll, be, I'll, make a, I'll make a side bet with you. Go ahead. I didn't say it. I said leads. How much is a side bet? Oh, you make me yawn. How much is a side bet? (laughs) On my own podcast, on my own network. On your own network. (laughs) Let me say it. Uh, (laughs) It's my network. I got to do a podcast tomorrow. (laughs) You do? So what? We didn't do one last week. We got to do one tomorrow. Uh, This new year, I'm giving out this uh, awesome hoodie. Uh, It's a YKWD hoodie we're going to give to the fan who emails. uh, Uh, Which one do you want to do? RK Patreon? Yeah, rkpatreon at gmail dot com. But what do we what, 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 what do we decide to do? You didn't <laughs> have a plan. You just said you're gonna give one away. Maybe you could have just fucking improv one. You fucking <laughs> fat cow. Well, this was the plan for you to make fun of me. So. Oh, uh, that was good. I like <laughs> your, th- your thought on your little tiny chubby feet. Um, I can say that because I'm chubby. You're not chubby. Uh, soon you won't be though because of your 30 day potato diet. Can you not degrade it with your passive aggression? I know. How can I you? How can you? I'm not. Why are you so passive aggressive? I'm not at all passive aggressive. You called it a 30 day potato diet. How do you eat something you look like? (laughs) (laughs) God damn it. I knew he had a good one because he he went, How do you? And he held it. (laughs) Shit. (laughs) You know what, dude? I don't look like a potato, dude. YKWD hoodie. I have one of these. They're fucking awesome. It's an XL. So if you're XL, if you're double X, sorry to say, we're going to give that hoodie away. That's cool. Because I even uh, see the envelope without an address on it. Yeah, we're going we're gonna to wait until we get an address. So here's the deal. Uh, tell us why you love the YKWD podcast, how long you've been a fan. And we're going to randomly pick uh, anybody from that list. We're going to put the thing in a hat. Names and we're gonna pick it out and we're gonna send you this hoodie because you guys are the best fans in the fucking world. How long is how long has it been now? Is it ten years? Maybe, nine years? Maybe eight, nine. I don't know. Awesome. It's got to be long because we've been doing ours for six years at yeah. least, seven yeah. years. Yeah, I mean, I we used to be over here, just that little corner of the room. Yep. I used to have to, I used to have to cut it off. I think right here. Why? What was here and here? All this Five, was six people. other stuff, gnome stuff. So I put all I did. He said you can have this front room, and I put a blanket up, 
Right. Uh, actually, curtains up right here. Is that the same curtain you bring to clubs? <laughs> I don't get it. To curtain off the second row. Get it? I, I, this is why it bugs me too. Is it Gabby didn't Did get you hear it? The I got have? it. No, you didn't. I yes, fully yes. got it. She fully got it because she's hip. Hipsters she, get my. She's humor. not a hip. She's a dip. She's not a dip. I'm just okay. trying to rhyme Dr. things Dr. with hips. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I got a Chinese. Question. I'd call her. A, what? I have a question. <laughs> What? What? You said, oh, yeah, downstairs you go, uh, the seller has a record label. Who's on the record label? They don't. Well, we're, we're, uh, Riotcast has a record label right now. Um, we actually, we just did uh, Mike Feeney's album. Very uh, funny. We're doing another. We just signed uh, Sarah Tolomash to do an album with Riotcast, right? And um so yeah, we with uh yeah, but, with with um the laugh button. Yeah, yeah, but you said the seller has a label. Well, they have a label too. They're they're doing uh they're doing albums too. When did they from the seller? Since when? She did Gary Vita Vita Las Vegas from Las Vegas. Um because they have the equipment to do it, so they're recording stuff. So they just started it. No, they've it's been around for a while. Who it's been around who for they a while. Have? Liz is the main person oh, who's yeah? getting it together, yeah. Good. So they have that's why they put the equipment to be able to record in the Pussycat. Village Underground or Las Vegas, so that you can make an album. But it's how can you make an album in Las Vegas when you're only doing twenty fucking minutes? Because you can do twenty minutes and then another different twenty minutes. That's forty, and then you can do a different twenty minutes, and that's it's so. It, it, put it together. That's sixty, Rich. Bingo. I know. I know. I know. But it, so it, three it's sets and you're done. I know. And then no, you can do you... another three sets and and redo it. So you're there all week. So you could actually. It's easier to do an album in Vegas. Because you're only doing 20 minutes. It's easier to do an album when you're doing a straight hour. You can, album, but yeah. most people don't do a straight hour rocking. Yeah. It's, sometimes it's better, but yeah. I heard right. Vita's album came out great. Who? What's his name? Gary Vita. Oh, yeah, yeah. I know that guy. Yeah. But anyways, yeah, we got a, we got a couple albums coming. <laughs> Chuck Chuck Nice, I think we're going to do one with. Chuck Nice. Whoa. Yeah. I love Chuck. He's Isn't he a good guy? Yeah, he's a great guy. Nice dude. Very How's he been? I haven't seen him in a while. He does the show with Neil deGrasse Tyson, right? He's doing great, yeah. Yeah. What's it called? He does, he does a Dark lot of, off. he does stuff that we can't do because he's nice. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> you know what yeah. I mean? Yeah. He's, he's a smiling. good guy. He's a great guy. I was in Aruba with him. He's fantastic. When? I like him a lot. Uh, last time I was in Aruba, was with Chuck uh -huh. Nice. So, I was, last week's Aruba was the shit, though. I God don't know. damn it. Who were you there with? Room was right on, the, literally, my balcony was right on the beach and right near the pool. Nice. What? 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 When? Tonight. Yes. <laughs> hmm. Why wouldn't you say it into the mic, you fucking chowder head? Stop being a sled dog. We have another uh, Joker cruise coming up in February. Yeah, I that know. That was fun when you guys were on it. Oh. It was fun. It was a good you time. You last year, you the year before. Yeah. We got ourselves through it. I piss I don't think that guy will ever use me again. What's his name? Jeff. Uh... Jeff Johnson? Yeah. Oh, I just canceled the uh, Whatever. Uh, planet... Uh, What's the, uh, what's the one in <laughs> what? Planet what? I'm not repeating it. I got to laugh. I'm out. Uh, the one in uh, Atlantic City. <laughs> I don't know. Planet. Howie Mandel's Club e books. Planet Hollywood. Yeah, because we're doing the Brigada, the tour, and that comes first. It's going to be fun. Tour always comes first, right? Well, I would. I mean, it's just math. Right. No, it's, 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 no you got to look at the big picture. It's not always math. You yeah, look at no, the big it's picture. math. You'd make more money doing the tour than you would doing that one date. If you took that one date and you would get replaced, and then we just keep that person. That's why I won't let. The, that's why I won't. That's more money. <laughs> yeah. It's math. <laughs> yeah, but it's math. It, you can't replace me. No, we could replace me if we had to. <laughs> no, you can replace anybody. Yeah, I know, but it's not the same. Oh, it's the same. No, it, the Supremes weren't the same without Diana Ross. You're not Diana Ross. Of this oh, I, sometimes I feel like you're her. Not, <laughs> <laughs> you're, 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 you're one of the pips. <laughs> <laughs> he wasn't with the one pips. You, whatever the you, fuck you were. You're not Diana you, Ross. You the fact that you think that you're fucking Diana Ross is nuts. <laughs> you're not Diana yes, Ross of the group. I am. No, you're not. I am. You gotta stop acting like a black woman. You're not. Stop shaking your hips. Yeah, don't cross your arms. You're weird right now. This cocksucker's ego is nuts. I love I have it. No it ego. It really is. You, no ego. It. You have a CD called Legend. No, I don't. Well, you call yourself a legend. No, people do. No, they call you a legend because you tell them that. You say, oh, I don't. Anyway, I go on the road, they say it. You have a shirt that says Legend, the legend. I sold them all. 
<laughs> I don't have any more. <laughs> I got to get some more. Good. Thanks for reminding me. Oh, my yeah. God. I know one thing talking about Voss, it could be about your dead, like if my father died. I have one. Exactly. <laughs> no. It goes back to him. Yeah, of course. He always, no. it all, some, no. at some point, you'll be talking, giving him a pep talk or talking about him. <laughs> at some point, you're like, dude, this club kind of, you know, I mean, they're all weekend and they did this. You know what? They did that to me too. And there's another club. I don't know why they don't use me. I've done well. It's like, I can it's tell not you about you right that now. won't use me. Yeah. <laughs> they just, they, I, why? I, who the fuck? No, you know, I'm not going to do bad on stage. You know that. You've seen me. Well, mm. no. Don't well. You know I'm going to kill everywhere I go. Well, you're going to do good. I'm going to kill. You're an okay dog. Look, I kill. (laughs) (laughs) I kill. You do great. I what? (laughs) I slaughter. I murder. You do great. I slaughter. Listen to me. You can't follow Uh, me. What? I did When we did the fucking... It's okay, dude. When we did the underground. (laughs) When we did the underground. Who closed? Who closed? Yeah, it was good. At the end, you finally got it, but... No, right from the beginning, I walked up, sat down, boom, boom, boom. We were a little was, nervous. I, I wasn't nervous. No, I, we were. The crowd, me, no, Liz. No, no, no listen. Uh, in Vegas, <laughs> for a week, I had to close. Yeah, every night. What the fuck is... I know, I got a fucking... Him, Keith, and Verzi. Him, Keith, Robinson, and Verzi, and I'm closing. Hey, if you're a legend, you yeah, gotta fucking yeah, be yeah, a legend. Yeah, it's, did it's I, but I did it. respect to the king. I, did, right? okay, yeah. I did it. You could do it. You could follow anybody. Yeah. He's a the good emperor. Comic, of course he can. A good, a good <laughs> comic. You. You're right. A good comic should be able to follow. Have one of my candies. Oh, thank you, sir. <laughs> thank you. You're welcome. Oh, Don't you The prince that? is happy. A good comic. Like, you could follow. Like, if you go to one of those open mics you go to, you're not scared to follow like Gabby, are you? No. You're not scared to follow him with your with your killer crowd work, are you? No. Okay. <laughs> I mean, when she's doing crowd work, you're yelling killer. Let me ask you a question because we're going to wrap up. I want to know what what are you going to do this year? What is your thing? What's this year, what are your plans? What is your... Well, we're going to sell uh, two shows, my wife and I. My wife, yeah. and then I'm producer on one and one producer, co-creator. Uh, we we will sell two shows this year. Uh, yeah. I'm gonna hopefully uh, do as much as I can to help this tour uh, go to the next level, whatever it takes to yeah. bring it to the next level. And I'm gonna we work have on my the house. opportunity. What's that? We we have the opportunity. And I'm gonna try to you know see what. Hopefully we get to the next level. Then uh, just keep writing and and work on the, my next CD. Hopefully my special gets sold this year. Right. Then I shot and you know I listen. I just keep creating and doing what I do. And, you know, that's all I could do is create and be funny. You know, I'm not going to... That noise. It's nothing. I'm sorry. So is that... I mean, uh, that's my plan in the business. My plan in life is, you know, to get my house in shape, have a nice barbecue this summer with all comics come by, you know, have a nice... Don't have it June 2nd. No. That's my barbecue. Yeah, don't I know. Fucking step on my. I would nose. never step on your. Now barbecue. that you got a backyard, don't fuck with me. No, I'm not gonna fuck <laughs> with you. I, I would never do that. I'm not that kind of person. I'll have it June first. No, dude. <laughs> <laughs> Mike, what do you hope for this year besides your own network and a my podcast. own podcast and my own network? <laughs> but what do you say? What I hope for? You said what are you? What are you gonna do? Or what are your? Yeah, well, you're what do you say what I Same hope thing. for? Hope? Well, no, when you're a prince, I you hope. gotta hope. You know what I mean? I'm not where you are, Rich. Oh, that's true. What's your hopes? <laughs> um, well. I think gonna I'm, I think I'm gonna have a kid. I think I'm gonna have a child. After talking about it with Smart you guys, decision. I think I'm gonna. You'd be a good dad. I would be a great. You know why you'd be a good dad? Why? Because you got you wear your heart on your sleeve. I do. I don't you got, understand. You have that. a big. You have a big heart, mm-hmm. right? Yeah, he's a nice guy. And he's a nice guy, but you can give all that love that you're looking for in other people and other things. Yeah. You could give it to that kid, yeah. and you'll get it back. And because I'm the same way, I wear my heart on my sleeve. I expect these. Okay, you also have gravy on your sleeve. <laughs> Gravy's not on the diet. There's flour in it. <laughs> I hope you choked to death. I don't oh. get that hard on the sleeve. What does that mean? You Throw wear your heart on your out. sleeve. Can I finish my fucking thing? You know, can I've been you tell me what that means so I can. Listen? This is why he's a fucking narcissistic. Yeah. I'm asking fuck. for you to give me. I'm help. not done with my pep talk. Oh, go ahead. It was, was good. A, I was enjoying it. It was a good one, right? Yeah, he fucking pissed he's not gonna have a kid. He's, not, he's making it. a joke to you that I, he's having I, a kid. I, I don't. I know that. I'm not a moron. He's playing you. He's not playing me, but I'm actually I'm reverting it into being serious, saying, you know what? 
I think he'd be a great dad because of be the, okay. the similarities between us. He thank, wears thank his you, liver on his on his pants. You're making another <laughs> joke about food on no his liver. Heart and sleeve. We got it. Yeah. I don't get the heart on the sleeve thing. I I wish your heart was on the floor right. Now. <laughs> yeah, I, I hope you grab your heart tonight and and fucking in your basement and That's... nobody hears you. <laughs> <laughs> they won't. They won't. <laughs> That's what I hope happens. I hope no, that shits on your head. No, you don't. Uh, Thanks for ruining it, Rich. What? Our moment. Ah, fuck your moment. <laughs> 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 what does that mean, though? Now tell me, wearing your heart on your sleeve. Wearing your heart on your sleeve, that means that you're... Um, I don't pussy. care. <laughs> 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 no, what is it? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm gonna do it again. Is that what we're gonna do? You think oh. I'm? You think I'm falling victim again? Uh, I don't really know what it means. I'm gonna look it up. It means <laughs> don't do it. <laughs> I, I'm for real. I don't. I hear people say it all the time. I go, what the fuck? Are those cough drops? Yeah. Thanks for offering me one. You fucking asshole. It's hard whole enough time. to hear you. That's how you get stuff in your life. Just scream at people and call them assholes. I got it, don't I? Yeah, <laughs> I know by threatening the fucking poor kid. No, I didn't. You didn't Thank even you. want to touch the candy. That's why. Yeah, but they're cough drops. What does that mean? It's easier to dose a cough drop. No, but he's too dumb to do that. Not dumb. You're a smart guy. I'm sorry. Shut up. Oh. Hard on your sleeve. What do you mean? <laughs> <laughs> We're back. It means when you, you know, your emotions are out in the open. Oh. Okay. Oh. <laughs> So wearing your heart on your sleeve, your heart is how you feel about people and, you you know, you care and stuff like that. And it, you, you actually get hurt a lot, you know, like because in this business, most people are fucking have no empathy and they have a very fake connection to you emotionally. I get it. You know what I mean? So you'll I'll become friends with this guy and friends with that guy and friends trying to make this connection with the people you'll never get because they just won't do it. But when you have a kid. That's your family. Yeah, I'm gonna your wife, your kid. The connection is real. It's yours, and you can, you can, you. The love you get is re is awesome and real. But you know, you try to get that in this business because we're looking for surrogate dads, surrogate families. We're always on the road. That club is our family for the weekend. Yep. It's surrogate, not surrogate. Surrogate, both of you. Surrogate, surrogate. 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 What did I say? Surrogate, <laughs> surrogate. Sorry, it sounded like surrogate. a town outside of Boston when you said it. <laughs> surrogate, it's like a drive-through surrogate. How funny is it that he corrected me wrong? I know, it's <laughs> terrible. And, and <laughs> we're just too stupid. We were just testing to see if you'd be a good dad because you know how to correct your kids. All right, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna f go fuck my wife. Yeah. You should go fuck your wife. That should be your I'm gonna podcast. I'm going to do it. I'm going go to go fuck my wife. Go fuck my wife. <laughs> and then tell the story about your kid. And I'll interview people who fucked my wife. Yeah. What? Talk about it. Go Anyways. ahead. And... Anyways, I love being a dad. I really, truly I do. did. Yeah. You did. I got a boy, too, I'm which tired. is way better. Yeah, than that's the thing. Dad. What? Way better than having a girl. Are you crazy? No. Have you ever tried your boy's clothes on? <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> <laughs> You're Sassy. such a fucking perv. Um, all right, well, listen, my man. kids are great. My daughters, oh, yeah. I mean, all three of them. I, I oh, oh my them. fuck, it's brand. These are brand new. Uh, They're brand new Tims. Yeah, well, yeah. where'd you get them, you fucking cheap? Brand fucker? new. I guarantee you got a deal on those. I didn't get them. You know I where these came from? Yeah. Uh, listen to this. The corner of Forty Second no. Street and Broadway. Oh, no, listen to me. It came with came a, out of a Hamilton trash bag. <laughs> that was <laughs> coming to mind too. These are brand. I just put glue in them. Brand new. Bring I, them back. I, this is how crazy I am. I can't take them out. When we did Bonnaroo the first year. Yeah, they had you know they have when they give away the tents where they give to celebrities. Yeah, I had a, these Tims for for ten years. I never wore them. Eleven or twelve years, they just sat in my closet. Yeah, I finally broke them out last year. Wore them twice. Look. Oh, sorry. What were you saying about your Tims? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, they're broke. Yeah, they're busted. Oh, glue. Do you they're, have any glue? Busted, do, do, do you have any glue? Yeah, I have glue. I carry Gorilla yeah. Glue all the time. <laughs> Fucking asshole. Nobody has glue. Back out of here. Right. Who was that? Fucking asshole. Look at the calendar next time, Rob. Right? Why do you, why are you mean to people? She, what'd you, come in here. What'd you say? Calendar says five. Do you have any glue on you? Does it say five? It says five, but there was a mix-up on the calendar. Who did the mix-up? Well, fucking boo. Our show was in there first, you dirty bitch. Oh, boy. It wasn't in there first. It wasn't there. But it wasn't in the calendar. It is now. 
Mm-hmm. It's fine. We're wrapping up. Oh, I'm glad this is not my network now. Uh, first of all, drop. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look at this. Drop your attitude, cocksucker. I don't have an attitude. I think you do. I don't have a attitude. Don't ever talk to Gabby that way. I love Gabby. Show love it. Her. What do you mean you love her? Do you wear your <laughs> fucking make out with me right now? Do you wear your heart on your sleeve? <laughs> I hope you die. Why did you say um, make out with me? Look he's at he's got you. food and stuff. What? Do you like him? All right, we're gonna no. leave, we're gonna wrap up right oh, I now. I liked him. Um, Robbie, I love him. We live in candy for you too. Oh, thank you. You're welcome. Uh, all right, listen, Voss. What do you got besides fucking? When I saw Hamilton, uh, arthritis yeah. <laughs> comes out. You got a, his brand new album is out right now. Where can we get it? Uh, iTunes and I guess the other places. Google and Play, Spotify, Google Play, Spotify, Spotify yeah. and. Creeps with Kids tour starts up in January. Creepswithkids.com. We're adding, we just got a bunch of new dates. Yes. We're, we're all coming. over the place. Look it up. And uh, follow you on Instagram at rich.voss. When is this going to play? The new Year's. Before New Year's. Sunday, day before oh, New Year's. Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. I'll be at uh, uh, go to richvoss.com, see all my dates. And But the Creeps with Kids tour is the main dates. Great. Mike, what do you got? Uh, my podcast, Amigos, at Amigos Pod. MikeFenoya.com for dates. Got a bunch of good shit coming up. DC, Denver. Awesome. All that stuff. And at Mike Fenoya. I need more followers. That's great, man. And I'm going to have thanks a Thanks for popping in. Dude. Yeah, thanks, <laughs> t- thanks Tim Dillon, for not coming. I hope you uh, get your own network someday. I hope one day. You know, I hope you I become a be, dad. I'm going to try. I'm going to yeah. really fuck her. Oh, you know, yeah. <laughs> well, just, you don't have to fuck her good. Fuck her and just come and leave it. Leave it in there. Leave it That's all. That's what you got to do. Just leave all it. All of it. All of it. All okay. the time. Just leave it. It's actually better. Take your dick out like a little squeegee. Your dick's fine. You can watch games. You don't have to do shit. Watch games. Yeah. Right. Um, <laughs> thanks for inviting me on the podcast. Guys, here we go it. right now. Mike, you, this hoodie right here, YKWD, designed by this fucking chucklehead over here with gorgeous hair. This fucking guy knows how to design shit. Yeah, yeah, he's he unbelievable. Does. <laughs> thanks. Right? Remember to be happy.com. Yeah. Make sure if you want your hoodie for Christmas or New Year's, go to remember to be happy.com. Get your hoodies, your booter. Everything's up there. The and um, the Buddha. Yeah. At YKW Dude Podcast uh, on Instagram. Yeah. At Robert Kelly Live on Instagram to follow you. Yeah. Creepswithkids.com. At Creepswithkids on Instagram. That's right. Get your tickets for the Gramercy Theater in New York. Those will be sold out before the probably the second week of January. Yeah, it's going to be gone. Then. So get them now. Oh, I can't wait for that gig, man. January 18th, the Emerald Theater in Detroit for yeah. Creeps with Kids. Uh, yeah. well, I'm going to be in Philly. This uh, when this comes out, yeah. So I'll be in Philly tonight, the Philly Punchline tonight. I think uh, and the and New Year's Eve. So get your uh, get your ticks and the Degenerates Netflix. Me, Jim Norton, Adrian Appalucci, Nikki Glazer, Miss Pat, Donnell Rollins. That's good. New Year's Eve Netflix. It's going to be the funniest fucking comedy show this year, guaranteed. Awesome. Yep. Follow Gabby at Gabby is Brian. And follow Mike, Mike V. Suarez. Uh, I have a new podcast coming out uh, where divorced <laughs> couples start to uh, try to date again, give it a second chance. It's called My Wife Dates Me. So, <laughs> what? What do you mean? <laughs> What do you, you really have up? one called My Wife Dates Me? No. Oh. He's making it up. Oh. He's being funny, you fucking. That was funny. That was good. <laughs> yeah. That was good. Can but you Gabby has a real podcast laugh? called. I have a real podcast, Unabashed Podcast. Follow me. I have a new show at the uh-huh. stand called Our Time of the Week. Next one is uh, January 7th, 7 p.m. downstairs, main room. Get your fucking tickets. Yes. When is it? Uh, the 7th. What day is that? Yes. Tuesday. Can I do it? Do you want to do it? No. <laughs> <laughs> and just know well, Luis Gomez fun. has yeah, Gabby's they, uh, panties on him. Can I have a call? Oh, let yes. me see that thing that you got. Um, shut up. Can I finish? I'm sorry. I, everybody's talking. Can I we finish? Okay. Zach, what do you have? Zach, the new guy. Chris, what do you got? Uh, yes. Here you go, buddy. Come on. Get on it. Not that Cheney.com. Stop acting like I don't ask you every fucking show. Go. Zach, what do you got again? Zach, the new guy still. I want to say Happy New Year's to all of you guys who listen. Thanks for coming to all my shows. What about that Come guy? Out. Will you shut he the fuck <laughs> up? Stop ruining my moments. Go ahead. You're a fucking moment ruiner. <laughs> it's all you do. I know. You fuck. <laughs> <laughs> crazy. <laughs> That's how you end the year. Happy New Year. You know what to do. We'll see you next year. <laughs>